post deload deadlifts. He's not feeling that great. What to do, y'all? We back at it. Preach your power. Last warm up here was not using straps during warm up. I kind of been using straps lately, but I don't know. It's been fucking with my form. Oh, look at the boy, man. Look at Hades, man. Oh, hey, here we go. I don't know. She just loves band work. And I don't care. She can fucking hit it because she does it really well. I think the point that the bar is pulling down and away from her makes her keep it toward her body more. But we're not doing... Oh, wait, here we go. It's the first... Yeah. So with straps and the kabuki bar, I can just, you know, do wide ass squats, which is what I essentially want to do with my form. I never want to be bent over the bar, which it happens on occasion, and I hate it. But I do, you know, applaud the straps for enabling me to just be able to sit back and pull. These are good pulls for Kelly. This is a deload for us. We're just trying to um, get. We were trying to get the program started. Really, it was part of the nine weeks. Kelly, we're on week three now. As you see this video, we'll be on week three, which sucks because you know we don't pay for editing and all that. We have full time jobs, so we live full time and edit. Ooh, a little slow on that lockout. So I was doing slow descends just so I can see where my um, imbalances are in my body. I could feel a little bit my footing was off on the right side. But they were moving. And I was just going for reps. Had my new sweats on just so I didn't like. I mean, I still shredded the fuck out of my legs. Oh, look at these pulls. I just love when she pulls that slack out. Like, hey. Her form has come a long way since we started this page, man. It's crazy. I think it's just the ability to be able to see yourself from a different view and see where you can improve or just like stay the same. Low bent over forward there. So I straightened up. Low uneven on that right side. Those are better. Just trying to essentially squat, like I said before. Got everybody in the background. They just hit heavy squats. They're, they're suited uh, lifters, so they be putting up crazy numbers. Bench, squat, deadlift. But, you know, we're in the right place, so we're going to do the same thing. God, that flew up. So she's come... She's been hitting leg press, squatting a lot more, you know, all the accessories. She's like, oh my God, my legs, they're coming back. They used to be the strongest point of my body. I'm like, they should always be the strongest point in your body. You know, a lot of pullers, they have great, great legs, but most of the times it's back that they're pulling with. And it's okay, man. Everyone has different body composition. i rather pull with my chest straight the fuck up whenever my chest is looking at the ground I have a horrible pull sped it up I guess damn oh god damn man I forgot this even happened bro little 295 come on it's nothing yoink using legs her butt doesn't wink up as much anymore. I love it. A little bit right there, but she pulls it back. We hit three. So SBD. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. It's kind of crazy with 87, 84% at the moment. But we're pushing through it. Reps is minimal, about three reps, not six. Oh, man. Look how short it me look, man. I had to pull the trigger, dog, because that pre-workout got to me. It wasn't even stem. It's regular pre, no stem, get a little pump. But after a long day in the sun, bro, it just got to me. 
especially it was a really hard training day. But we appreciate y'all, man. Uh, Keep rocking with us. We almost at 150 subscribers, on dog. 150. <laughs> Let's go, y'all. Skelly game. We out. Deadly genie is not fun. It's not a trend. This is real life. <laughs> but we gotta do what you gotta do. We out.